Deep Down Cleaning, your one-stop cleaning outfit for Deep Down Results. John Moore reporting for sportsandmore.com from the Anaganish Arena. I'm joined by Jody McDougall of Dr. John H. Gillis uh, joining in. Tell me a little bit about, about the loss. A little disappointment here, obviously, losing in the, in the gold medal game. But uh, tell me from your perspective about this game and the team's performance. Well, we didn't come out on top in the beginning. We didn't bring our A game, and it showed there in the game. So, shitty time, way to lose your last game. But... We just needed to put the puck in the net more, and we didn't do that. But this team accomplished so much this year. It was a great ride, right? Tell me, tell me about the ride, and uh, obviously I understand you didn't want silver here today. You yeah. wanted gold, but, but what a ride for this hockey game. Um, it was a really good season. That was our first loss of the season, so we played good all season. We got the regional banner, but we just didn't finish it in the end. <laughs> but you had to, be, to, w to win as many games, to go on that streak, what? Why was this team able to do that? What, what are the strengths of this, this team? Um, our goaltending is really strong, and our defense and offense are just strong all around. We can put the puck in the net a lot, and we have good, strong defense. And uh, as far as you're concerned, of course, this is it, right? This yeah. is it. You're moving on. Tell me, give me some thoughts here. I know you'll have to have it let us settle in over the weeks ahead, but tell me your thoughts on what, what's next for you and, and what this high school hockey well, yeah. hockey really does a lot for someone like. <laughs> okay. Yeah. It's, a, it's a big part of your life, right? Yeah. It's a real big part of your life. Yeah, like every day we're at the rink and it sucks that it's over now, but it was good while it lasted. The relationships, obviously, the friendships in the, in the room. That, that, tell me about that and, and, and just what that's going to <laughs> Well, all my best friends are from hockey. It's a really good way to get friends and. We're all really a close-knit team, and it was a great season with them. And I know right now it, it hurts to have it come to an end and, and to have the silver, but, but I think perhaps weeks later from now you'll look back and, and those friendships are still going to be as strong as ever. Yeah, it was a good season. We'll look back on it on a positive note. Just sting a little bit right now. <laughs> Well, again, unfortunately, uh, the silver, but what a tremendous season you had. Uh, congratulations on your season, and congratulations to the team. Thank you. Brianna McDonald uh, joining me here following a 4-1 loss to Citadel in the gold medal game here at the Provincials. Uh, obviously disappointed to come away at the silver, but uh, tell me your thought, your, your perspective on what happened here this afternoon. Um, I think we came out strong, but I, the other they played a strong game. Um, we got down... And then, but we came back and we kind of just got down a couple goals and it was just hard to come back from that. Like, it was kind of disappointing. We were, we were never down in this tournament earlier, so it was hard to come back, I think is what happened. Never down earlier, but all season long, this team rolled off wins after wins, just kept on, on winning. Tell me about the team. Obviously, it's a very good hockey club. Again, not getting the goal, but to tell me about the strengths of this team. Uh, well, we have eight seniors this year. And so that was really, like, we've started, I'm one of the seniors, and we started, so we've, a lot of us have been playing since grade nine, so we kind of worked and built up with the team. And so, yeah, we had really strong defense, and we scored a lot of goals from the point, and our defense had really good shots, and then our forwards were really good at tipping, and they battled, and we were, we were really good battling, like, uh, well, Brianna, tell, tell, what, when, now the season's over, what, what are you going to take away? Obviously, you've got your silver medal, uh, but when you look back on this season, what to you, what are, what are the highlights, whether it be personal or a team? Um, you made a lot of friends playing. Like, we've played together since, a lot of us have played together since we were in, like, Adam, and so, like, you take away friendships, and you've learned a lot from just dealing with people and just having fun, and you've obviously the hockey skills too and uh, as a goaltender uh, goaltenders have they have these reputations of being little quirky personalities <laughs> but but again what's next what's next for you obviously high school's going to come to a close do you want to continue with your hockey career um i don't know i'm going to upei next year and i'm taking kinesiology so i'm not sure if i I'll, i might try out but we'll see what kind of what happens next year i guess just spoke to one of your teammates. She's pretty emotional. Uh, some tears, and understandably so. Um, tell me, how hard was this to accept for the for the team again? 
not only having to accept the silver, but ho on home ice. It was hard. Like we, yeah, there was a lot of tears in the dressing room. It was, and especially, and I think a lot of it was just, a lot of it was eight of us were graduating and it was, I think it was part of that was just, it was, we lost, but it was because we, it was our hockey was kind of over. It comes to an end. Brianna, thank you for joining us here and taking time out. And uh, again, good luck at UPEI. Thank you.